Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. I am Haja, a passionate makeup artist and online instructor. In this tutorial, I want to teach you how to apply flawless and long-lasting red lips. Red lips are so expressive on their own that they can be the only focus of your evening glam. Just apply your mascara and maybe a pop of sparkle or shimmer on the lids and put the focus on the lip makeup. You have probably heard that women in history always popped in a red lip whenever they wanted to make an impact. So how about first learn how to apply it correctly so you can be the next powerful woman. If you want to apply your red lips right from the tube without any prepping then go ahead but just know they are not gonna last you long plus start to smudge around the edges. Especially if you plan to wear red lips for an occasion you better follow the upcoming tips. So first of all, we do an in-depth lip skin prepping. We need to scrub the lips for all the dead skin cells to be removed. I'm using a do-it-yourself lip scrub, which consists of two simple ingredients, one teaspoon brown sugar and half teaspoon of olive oil mixed together. Then we start to apply the product all over the lips and gently massage the lip scrub onto the lips. I'm using sweeping motions as well as circular motions with my fingers while massaging it onto my lips. Other than removing dead skin cells, the scrub also stimulates the blood circulation of my lips which make the lips overall appear bigger. After scrubbing for a minute, leave the scrub on for another minute, then take a dampened cotton pad and remove the product from the lips gently. <laughs> Afterwards, we hydrate the lips with a lip balm. I'm using the Labello Sun Lip Balm with an SPF of 30. Just apply the lip balm all over the lips. Just do not apply excess product, a thin layer is enough. Now let it absorb or in case you have applied a lot of product and your lips feel slippery, then just dab a tissue on the lips gently to remove excess product. Simply because if the lips are too slippery, the upcoming products might not last long. Next, we start applying our red lips. We begin to contour the lips using a cool red lip contour pencil by Huda Beauty in the shade Heartbreaker. We start on the center edge of the lower lip and apply small strokes from there going back and forth. Make sure your elbow is placed on a flat surface and lean your pinky on your chin for more stability while working. Then we align the cupid's bow of the lips by following the natural shape of the lips. Here's a note, if you work with bold colors like red, preferably do not reshape the lips or overline them too much because in the end it will be obvious and look very unnatural. Furthermore, even out the cupid's bow with the lip pencil because we all do have slightly asymmetrical lip shape. Then apply small strokes until you have framed the whole lips. Once the lips are contoured, go ahead and fill in the lips with a lip pencil. This helps the red lipstick to last longer. I also go into the lip folds with the lip pencil to make sure the application does not turn patchy. Next, slightly open your lips to get into the outer edges and even out the application further. Finally, we switched our liquid matte lipstick by Huda Beauty in the same shade as the Lip Contour Heartbreaker. A cool red is appealing and timeless on almost every skin shape, but of course you can also go for a warmer red if you feel like it suits you better. I do not use the lipstick wand, instead I apply the product on the back of my hands and use a lip brush by Alpha Makeup to apply it. Important with liquid matte shades is to work with thin layers, that is how they do not dehydrate the lips throughout the day and also stay on longer. So first apply a thin layer all over the lips, starting in the center of the lips and working our way to the edges with the brush. Please note to let the first layer dry before applying the next layer on top. <music> 
After we are satisfied with the intensity of our red, we move to the correcting step. Use cotton swabs dipped into makeup remover and stretch the skin to even out any unevenness. Next, we use a light shaded concealer plus the same lip brush but clean to frame the outer edges of the lips with the concealer. This not only makes the application precise and clean but also makes the red lips pop out more. Apply a thin layer of concealer and slightly blend outwards with the brush. Then go in with your fingers and dab the concealer until there are no obvious edges left. Then we set the concealer with setting powder while pressing the lips together to get around the lips easier. For the last step, we use a tissue to blot the lips. This will help to get rid of excess product that would transfer onto skin or the teeth. This is how you apply red lips that make a statement whenever and wherever you are. There is this saying on a bad day there is always red lipstick and I cannot agree more with it since I definitely feel more confident beautiful wearing red lips. I hope I could inspire you to go for this minimalistic but yet expressive makeup look. I would appreciate it if you take the time and subscribe to my channel and hit the bell notification to not miss out on my tutorials every Sunday. Also, please leave me a thumbs up if you like this video and share it with whomever you think needs to try this out. Thank you and see you later!